By morning, the family home had an unusual path. Members of immediate family and extended family covering sections of the home. In an anticipation was a press brief, whose details were until the release tight-limped. An area had been gazetted. <laughs> By midday, expected occupants to fill the zone began to walk in. Sewanyana's lawyer, Arias Lukwago, for an internal brief with the family that listened intently. The family has since his rearrest made a frantic search that has not yielded. They told us to go to ICE, uh, is it CMI in Chireka to find out where he is. Apparently it's called Wembley. So when we reached there, uh, Council Baker entered and uh, talked to the OC of the place. He was, told, he was the information they gave him, Honorable Alan Sawanyana is not here and they don't have him in records. What we are witnessing today is a reincarnation of what has been happening in the past. The construct of the political landscape in this country is no different from what has been happening during those terrible regimes we always condemn, the Amin regime, the Obote regime, and the rest. His wife, Namatalidia, says the family is now stepping up for alternatives, tasking the defense ministry for answers. All I'm asking for, whoever is detaining my husband, should tell me where my husband is. We have kids to raise together. I need, him, I need to know where he is. If he's dead, you can provide me with the body. Then I bury my husband of something that I will show my, my kids that your father was buried there. Actually, I, as a surety, I have a duty to make sure he attends court. I don't know where he is. We should ask them because they were in an anti-terrorism police uniform of black. We don't know whether they killed him, whether they... they so they, they should be the one to explain where is Honorable Baran Sewanyana. On Monday, the lawyers will file for the member to be brought before a judge or secure his release. We are seeking for a writ of habeas corpus to compel the security agencies that are holding him hostage or captive. Because it's not arrest. He's being held captive. He's in captivity. To produce him before courts of law. We then proceeded to the MP's parents' home in Salama. The family is helpless for answers. But they should bring back his body. At least I bury him. My son has done nothing wrong to this world. You may think you're hurting Sewanyana, but you're hurting us, the whole family, and the people he has been taking care of, his children, wife and parents. Sewanyana, who is battling charges related to the spate of murders in Masaka, was on Thursday released on bail. In a dramatic turn of events at Chigo Prison, the legislator was intercepted by the operatives who arrested the MP. He was whisked away in a Toyota Hens van, commonly referred to as drone. His capture has bred an uproar from sections of public, salaming lawlessness and breakdown in the rule of law. Lawyer Elias Lukwago has also tasked the legislative arm to protect its members. Although the Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Bolanya, has a different opinion. The privileges that I understand very well are those that protect free speech and action taken in the chamber of this parliament. If we should go and do things contrary to the law in some other place, or insult somebody in some other place, you could uh, be immediately taken from there without any recourse to anybody. It is the latest in a history of similar tests. Flavian Inguze, CTV, PM Edition. <laughs> Yeah.